Hello everyone, this is Ishika Khosh, currently a student of second year MBBS at Vindapur Medical College and Hospital. Today at Analytical Minds, I'm gonna give you a detailed discussion on the UG life at my college. So without any further delay, let's begin. A few days back, the Analytical Minds has sent me a list of topics which I should cover in this video. So here's my list. And the first question goes, how was the first day at your college? So on the first day of our college, we were all taken to the auditorium where the inaugural ceremony was to be held. And there our principal sir, our dean sir and all the other professors warmly welcomed us. They told us about the rules and regulations of the college, the do's and don'ts. And most importantly, they introduced us to the world of MBBS. After their speech was over, we were all taken to our consecutive lecture theatres where we were handed over the schedules and then our subject HODs came like the first year subject HODs of Anatomy, Physiology and Biochemistry they came and there was a short introductory session So this is how my first day went So let's go on to the next question How is your college different from the other medical colleges? Let me tell you one thing clearly. All the medical colleges under WBUHS are more or less similar. The books followed are same, the syllabus is same, the academic calendar is same, the schedule is same and uh, everything, every official works are same. So there is no such huge differences between two colleges. Yes, the places matter, where the colleges are located, that matters. But apna college to apna college hi hota hai. So I must say my college is the best. So let's move on. How is the campus? Midnapur Medical College and Hospital was established in the year of 2004. And the campus, I won't say it's huge. But yeah, it's big enough. We have the main academic building. We have the hospital building. We have the building for mother and child care. We have the girls hostel, the boys hostel, we have the emergency wards, the OPDs and also the PGTs hostels are also there. So if we take it as a whole, the campus is very big. We have playgrounds as well. And regarding the infrastructure, as you will say that uh, so old college the infrastructure must be very weak now. But it's nothing of that sort. The infrastructure is very good and it's redoing day after day and our labs are very well equipped and the classrooms are AC all the lecture theatres are air conditioned now the next question how is the teaching faculty? I must admit that we have got the best group of professors at our college they are very knowledgeable their teaching style is so unique like uh, for example they share their real life experiences with us on certain topics so that we can understand it more easily and uh, they are very cooperative they also are very patient no matter how many times you ask them a certain topic they will always explain it to you so we are very lucky to have such professors in our college so now the next question how is the patient load as you all know that Midnapur district is quite big so you can imagine the rush in our hospital. We have patients from all the rural uh, areas in Midnapur district which sums up to a huge amount of patients daily. So moving on to the next question, how is the hostel life? So there are two separate girls hostel and boys hostel at our college and uh, per person we get a bed, a wardrobe and a table and all of which sums up to only just rupees 12 per month. Yes, you heard it right. It's just rupees 12 per month for the accommodation and fooding is different. Okay, the next one is how is the senior junior relationship? As you all know that the seniors play a major role in your college life and we are very lucky to have such good seniors. They are very helpful and they are always uh, there to help you out in any problems you face regarding academics or your life problems. They are very cooperative and they are very helpful. 
Now regarding the fee structure and the bond details at our college, it's the same as every other medical colleges in West Bengal. So you can check the website for that. It's all given there very clearly. Now comes the most important topic, our college fest. Yes, we have an annual college fest named the Impulse and it's officially organized by the third top students. And besides this, we also have many other events like the Saraswati Puja, the Borsha Borod program. So this is it. So I would like to end today's session by giving a small piece of advice to all my juniors out there. As you are entering a medical college, I can assure you that you are going to have the best years of your life. Please enjoy it to the fullest and also don't forget to study. And also, thanks a lot Analytical Minds for having me here. Thank you.